Sometimes you feel like a nut. Hello guys, welcome back to my time at Porsche. Done some grinding in between episodes to get some ghouls. Had a long way to go, but I got lucky in like in the past week. The last, I think the, out of the last 10 commissions, I think I've gotten three uh, double S commissions. I can see our baby sheep that we got are just about fully grown. So I won't have to pet them much longer. Looks like Ack hasn't been over here to clean up. Uh, it's a Wednesday, so I need to get up to the commissions. Oh, come on, get on the horse. Oh, this way. Should be fine. Perfectly 8 o'clock. Perfectly timed. No double rank, uh, double S rank commissions, wooden pillars, satchels, gunpowder. Yeah, we'll take the gunpowder just to get the rep with Arlo, which we're doing fine. What are you going to take, Higgins? Come on, you're going to take those towers, aren't you? He took the satchels. Really? All right. I can't get the conveyor belt mission anymore, maybe because they know I got too much quality leather. I actually got a lot of those uh, bridge uh, bridge towers. And I had to make a lot of hardened clay the past couple of days. Now the market is still, I mean it's great for buying, sucky for selling. We're making our headway with uh, scraps. He is now an associate with us. Which now means I can get some more points by petting him three times. We got a few gifts that we need to hand off as well today. Actually, we got a lot to do today. Was that three times? Yes, it was. Uh, that's wrong. No, that's where I'm going the right, right spot here. I actually want to speak to Martha. I wish my son would stop dreaming about a life of adventure. Why can't he just have a peaceful life here in Portia? Uh, maybe because it's too quiet for him? But I got enough of this material so I started making her feather dusters because apparently that's what she likes. I'm pretty good friends with Carol now. I think I get a 20% discount at her store. Uh, there's scraps. Did, did I just... There he is. Like, where's Remington? There, I try to give Remington every day. We're sort of a frontier town. Yes, I know. You say the same thing over and over again. And then I hand you a lemon juice. At least he didn't say today. I didn't think I'd ever get, to, get a gift like that from you. Now, hopefully, both of these guys are in here. It's Albert's birthday. Hi, Peanut. Need to upgrade your work desk? You can count on us. Uh, is my work desk already upgraded all the way? Was that changed? Uh, it's your birthday, isn't it? Right? Yes, it is. There we go. And Gust... The materials my father uh, got me, they came from you, right? Really like to be nosy, hmm? Oh, well, okay, so this was off cam. Uh, the mayor gave me a quest because Gus was trying to do a project for someone else and couldn't find material. So I got material for his father and gave it to him. Uh, apparently he doesn't like that. But he gave me 40 relationship points, okay. Uh... My master Verna in Atara was a great architect. Her designs were always so brave and open. They just flowed. I hope to match her level of skill one day. And here you go, sir. An umbrella for you. And out the door. We'll make sure we get our commission done today. Then we'll start doing 
some of the stuff we need. I also reached level 45, so I'm wearing the pants and the hat is upgraded. Let's go in here. Gunpowder. Six, confirm. Why we're also here. I need to run into the factory for a second. Uh, I ran into Mint out in the woods and he was trying to sleep and he was, he kind of gave us a mission. Well, he didn't give us a mission. He just said he wished he could sleep better. So I, quote unquote, our character thought of, you know, making him a pillow and a sleeping mask. Not really sure what that's going to do for him, but you know what? Hey, uh, wait, why are we here? Wind pillars, aluminum plates. So I need to grab aluminum plates while we're here and more concrete blocks like that. Alright, uh, oh this is the quest for mint. So it's chance meeting a pillow, a sleep mask and pillow, huh? For me he says? I can't think of anyone else that would do that for me. Thank you, it's very useful. 15 relationship points. Ooh, 1,500 ghouls. That's not bad on 30 rep points. Looks like Arlo might be roaming the streets down here. There you go. Yeah, I know. If I run into any trouble, don't. No. Holy crap. Arlo became my best friend, so I got rep points with uh, Ack, Remington, and Sam. I always hit that button. Uh, what do I muzzle? I muzzle pet jelly while we're here, right? Uh, one time's good enough for you, jelly. So now we're gonna come in here because we got the cash to upgrade the house. I have no idea how much bigger it's gonna be or or what house. Work table. I do want to move this anyway, so let's actually... Uh, you know what, for now... We're just going to put it here. Okay, now the house. We want to upgrade, and we got the cash and all the right materials for it. And I'm over on a lot of this stuff except for the attack bonus. But yeah, let's. Oh, I think this is the final stage of the house as well. And it appears to be a lot bigger. It's a hell of a lot bigger. Uh. All right. Uh, let's cancel this for a second. Assembly station. Let's just move this. Kind of like right there for now. Oh, that street light is going to be in the way. Upgrade. Confirm. Can I get this? There's enough room in here. All right, so we got we got to move a couple things around. I think that's the final stage of the house, though. I'm not sure, but it could be. Uh, let's pick this up. Let's put that there for now. that there that can go there a relic machine J 
jelly. Just don't get in my way. Because I need you in a second. Oh, our workshop area is going to look like trash for a day or two until I can figure out exactly what I want to do with it. But as long as everything is accessible when we do so, All right, I can see those planters. So it looks like I'm gonna have to move the stable. So we'll just put that down there for now. I definitely think that's the final stage. Stable. Uh, we'll move this just over here like that. Now we can move the house. To there. Because I want to run the big planters all the way around it. Oh, nuts. I didn't. Uh. Oh, wait a minute. The house sticks out a little bit further there. But I do want to give some room. I'm just trying to get some room so when I put the big planters around to walk around. Alright, so now the yard looks so small. <laughs> so, so small. Uh, assembly station. I mean, for now, we can just pop the assembly station, like, right here. And then the stable. We can move that. We'd probably like to put it actually, like, right here. But for now, I think we'll rotate it. That's not a bad place for it right now. Because the one thing I, I want to do, and I'm not going to have the cash for it now, is A&G sells marble. I want to put it like around the foundation so it looks like the house is sitting on a foundation. But I kind of like how the assembly station has like an overhanging deck over the crock plots and everything. All right. Now I'm thinking about uh, upgrading the fence line as well. Change appearance. So you got the wooden. I'm trying to see what the stone looks like. And marble. I kind of like the stone look. I don't want the, there's too much wood around here with the with the uh, crop plots. So I'm thinking stone. What do I need for stone? Stone pillar, stone fence. Stone... Actually, it's rather cheap to change the fencing. Alright, but I know we can buy this in their store, but... Right now, I think we got everything the way... We gotta get settled with what we have now. Well, hello, Jelly. And it's probably something I can actually fiddle more with on the weekend. Oh, and I gotta plant a whole bunch of stuff in the crop plots because our bamboo papaya was all harvested. I did pet the sheep this morning, I did. So 
So the stable is here. They're kind of being fed. Now also the fish tank. Some good news by keep putting dough and the bug eggs in there. I have one, two, three, four, five, six. I got, I reproduced two of those. Uh, I even forgot what fish they were in there. And I even reproduced a blue mackerel and those are all emperors in there. So, uh, bug eggs and uh, dough you need to put in there. Uh, I got a couple more blunders because honestly, I've been having some issues not having enough. <laughs> I've been using the blunders a lot lately. So for what they cost, I was like, yeah, you know what? We'll just, we'll just make a couple more blunders. Can I sneak that there? Of course not. For now, that's where it's going to go. Oh, I got stuff everywhere now. I'm not sure where everything is. Building stuff. Concrete. Corn and ingots. That needs to go in there. And I'll just hit sort all. And I'll probably have some stuff left over. Helper's chest. That needs to go in there. So Ak can do his thing. Let's just go and take a quick look at our new house. I think that's the final state. I probably should look while I was in the ANG store. Well, it looks like the same on the inside, other than the walls are just a little bit better. How are my stats looking now? Well, I'm still way over on defense, so... <laughs> Maybe I can sell, you know, go through here and see what, uh, like a llama sculpture. I can probably, that might be something I could bring to the museum. Uh, if I put that in inventory. You place in the house receive bonus attributes. I might be able to put that outside. I mean, I'm still way over on defense. I think I'm getting all the defense from the toy robots. I think I got a whole bunch of toy robots in here. Yeah, 19, 19, 19, yeah. That's where I'm getting a lot of my defense from. Wall lamps might be able to go. Yeah, I can look at that some of the time when I'm not fiddling. Fiddling around here. I don't know what you would do with all these rooms. Maybe in the future, we could do something. But now I can probably start organizing the house a little bit. Maybe even decorating it. But what I also do off cam is I want to put large planters around the house, or maybe you can even do that today. Let's clean up our yard a little bit. Alright. Now the problem with putting the marble down is you gotta kinda like lay it around the foundation of the house, move the house and run the foundation around it. Back on the inside. Uh, I forgot where I was going with it. Nope, nope. Uh... I was going to say, I hope I got more than, more than that. I probably should have grabbed the trees as well that I need to plant. Nope. Stop it. There we go. Well, at least they uh, got the dimensions right, so... I was like, am I going to have a gap when I go through? Or 
Wait, what? What? I am in the corner, right? Uh, devs, did you uh, make the found? Oh crap! That's what they did. So what am I to do with this little narrow gap here? What am I to do with that little narrow gap, guys? Okay. Alright, so I got crystal trees and those to plant. I guess those can go back in there. I got too, too, too many. I mean, I guess I could... Well, I'll think about that. Have to think about that. But the bright side, we gotta look at the bright side. That we got, we got the house. I think we're fully upgraded. I can check. Uh, oops. I can check A and G. Two, three, four. So I can buy four more trees. Also, what I want to do, because we got the cash, I don't know if he's still open. Is we're going to buy ourselves the white horse. Yeah, because we got cash everywhere. Permanent for sale. Success. Uh... We'll pet him to not a super location. All right. Well, okay. Nope. Wrong button. Uh, where's Jelly? Come on, Jelly. You got a friend now. Your friend won't be played with that much. Interact. Jelly might get jealous now. <laughs> Maybe it's a good idea naming him Jelly. Return. Return. You can also return. Uh, stable. Alright, let's, uh... Well, we'll just start training it in certain things. And when you get to a certain point, we'll just call it good. Now the only thing is, I hope Act can feed them from here, but I can move the, I can move that down here further. Yeah, these tanks take up. Yeah, the tanks are. I was thinking about maybe moving these tanks to the backside, but then that'll leave me a gap or, or make another tank. But they take up a 4x4, four four, which is same what this big plot takes up. Or I can just put two small plots back there. Uh, what are these large, small. Uh, what day of the month is it? Anyone know? Spring, summer, autumn. We'll just grab those. Come in. I mean, I can always move this stuff around. I am just not quite sure with it because it looks kind of stupid. I just have no stuff on the front here because of the gate and I haven't been over there so yeah I'll figure out something or nothing at all you know maybe it'll be hidden so much I won't even notice it <laughs> that's what I'm hoping for 
also I'm getting to the point I'm not really care about the fertilizing thing. It seems to be going through so much fertilizer, and I know it probably helps you yield, get more of a yield from the crops. But right now, I'm just thinking I've been spending so much money on fertilizer. I, I would like to make it myself, which I could, but it takes mucus, which seems kind of weird. And I use mucus for a lot of things. And I stop asking questions why. And holy crap, it's already past midnight. Uh, where were we? Alright. Potato fruit only takes two days? Alright. Not really sure what potato fruit is, but... We will plant them anyways. I think they're good for the animals. I think it's a growth of 20. So I guess if you run out of lettuce, you can feed them that. I probably should have moved the cow pen just a little bit more forward. Because you can see in a second, I can't put small uh, crock plots behind them. I kind of want to leave the cow stable here. Only because when the new patch came out, the tree was here. <laughs> and I kind of like having the tree there. And it's not going to hurt if I move this a little bit forward. Let's put that away, that away, and we'll hit sort all. Oh, I would have loved to put that there. Kind of right out front. It might be in the way when we come in and out for now, but... We'll see what happens with it. Uh, sort all. Yes. These can go up here because those are gifts. And I want to get the Carol because I want to actually upgrade uh, our hat. Like I said, this is level... Nope. Face this way, sir. Uh, this is the level 45 equipment. I was trying to zoom in, but it's kind of hard. And you can actually upgrade these things by going to Carol because she has a sewing machine. The only thing I would need, but I think I got tons of it, is right here. This stuff. Flexible fiber. I got 257 of them, so that should be enough. Matter of fact, let me just grab that now. Uh, yeah, it's too late in the evening to try to do anything else right now. Heck, we did a lot. I mean, we built the house. I think it's our final upgrade. And I think the storage chest can actually go up there now. And uh, we got the white horse. Now he's got to train him. And I got to think of a name for him as well. I'll think of something. I got a lot of thinking to do, man. I don't like this thinking game. Ah, uh, our bed. Actually, before we go to bed, I even changed our picture with Phyllis. It's too bad you can't see the pictures a little bit better. Uh, oh, and I passed out. So. <laughs> and it's a Thursday. Now I gotta see how much money I got left over. But we kind of need to head up and get the, you know, check out the commissions. Well, the sheep are at 100%, but they're not fully grown yet. But they will be tomorrow. And I may not, I may get some more in a couple days when I got more time to pet them, if that makes sense. 
Now the question is, am I going to have a hard time getting out of here? Yep. Come on, Jelly. Teleport. Where are you? There you are. Yep, I'm late getting up there. Higgins is going to grab something good, man. Uh, it doesn't like Higgins has even been here yet. One water tower, 5,000 ghouls, small satchels, no. I do it for the money. What else was there? 500, 3,600 for a water engine. Looks like he took the water engine. Uh, if we look at the stats, uh, yeah, it's, <laughs> we're already double with Higgins right now, so. I just want to make sure I, I just want the double S rank commissions because I can I can push those out pretty quickly because I'm pretty well I'm getting pretty well stocked up at this point. Now I got to go through my routine. Uh, yeah, dude, I know you told me that yesterday. Uh, have an umbrella. Now I'm hoping by. Up in my friendship with him, which would be easier, that my friendship with Ginger will go up as well. Now, I'm just going in here for a couple of reasons. Home, max level. Assembly station, max level. Work table, max level. The shed. I want to move that just forward enough. Thank you. The stable, I want to move that. Just over a little bit. Like that. Just to give room to get more access. Uh, if I go to the factory. This is what I want to do with a house. But I want to do it in marble. So basically what I did for the factory. Is I went around the outside of the factory. Of the outline of the factory. Then I moved the factory. And then you work yourself. Inward by one. Maybe two layers. Put it down, then you can put the factory back down. Underneath this factory is basically all grass. I'm pretty sure most people would know that trick. But what I would need... How many ghouls I got? Actually, I got 16,000 ghouls. That's not bad. But this is the marble. Marble Made of marble, it can be used for decorating the yard, of the, the yard floor. Now, what you got to be careful of is... summer themed floor that can be placed down in your house uh, in your house so it's only the marble oh now look at the market price 104 is it because I spent all that cash yesterday the market thinks it's going great because I spent I don't know how much cash yesterday buying the horse in the house But the good news is, we got all of the land. We got the house. I can start saving ghouls to now start decorating the house. Where's your dog poo? There it is. Nope. Don't go anywhere yet. Every point will count, because eventually you become our buddy, and then maybe you'll live with us like uh, Pinky does. Now I did see down at the harbor, the harbor has a store and they actually kind of like sell uh, toys for pets. Uh, Carol's down here. Martha, sorry. I wish my son would stop uh, I know, you said that yesterday. You can have one of those. All right. Oh yeah, we gotta make a water tower. So let's go back to the house. After we say hello to Phyllis. Hey. Uh, hey. <laughs> I like how she says hey. Yeah, I like this. I really want to wear my bikini, but I can't swim. What a shame. And I, I'm thinking, <laughs> you can still wear the bikini. <laughs> All right, uh, bandages.
All right, let's grab our stuff. No more resources. That's what you think. Sort all. Yes, please. Oh, we were down to care. Well, okay, we're here. We'll get the water tower going. Uh, actually, now I can come on this side. All right, you're... I can train you again. Train. Nope, wrong. Train. Train speed. Actually, it doesn't look like he's going to be taking long to train. Uh, water tower. I know I need, because I've done enough of these recently. Where are they? Actually, I need to run to do some dungeon runs again. I went th through all my, uh, what is that, thermal temperature liquid stuff to make hardened clay. Water tower. Water tower. Confirm. I did pet these guys this morning. Yes, I did. Okay, so now what I got to start figuring out is how to decorate our house a little bit on the outside. Uh, one, two, three, four. Jelly, come here. Why that's being built? Really? Get on the horse. The church is just right down here. And let's see, what do we want to buy for trees? Uh, I'm actually thinking crystal trees. Because that stuff probably sells better than apricots. We're going to have apricots growing out of our ears at some point. It was either going to be apricots or crystal because they look better, in my opinion. They're leafy rather than bare trees like that. All right, what I need to do is, is this even possible? How close can you get? Nope, nope, stop it. There's one. There we go. Looks like our water tower is done. Uh, this does not need to be on anymore. Unless... Uh, I can make more... Can I... Uh, dough. I need more flour. Apparently. Flour takes wheat. I don't want to use my wheat just yet. I only got 33 resin. I could probably use some more resin. Fuel depleted. Yeah, not a problem. Uh, so let's go down here. Start making some more resin. And... Craft more resin. Now see, I can make my own fertilizer, but it takes mucus. The bones are not a problem, the feces is not a problem, it's the mucus I tend to have a problem with. Alright, so, wow, it's already in the afternoon. Alright, so, let's go hand in our commission for the day. There he is. Thank you. Now, also since last recording, we did skip a not skip a month, but we passed the end of the month. So I did get the 10,000 ghouls for being the top builder for the month. So that also helped. Uh, I did talk to Scraps today, right? Yeah, gift and interact can't do that. So if I come up to Carol and revise which clothing do you want to modify this time 
So this is my level 40 hat. I'm now level 45. It gives me 400 hit points. Now, if I really like the hat, I can confirm. It'll take the Traveler hat. It revises it, and it gives me max hit points 250 and resilience 30%. Okay, so if I come here, I get 500, 500 hit points. So I'll be giving up hit points by gaining resilience. No, Carol, come here. Uh, revise. And now I know the problem is this is a low level hat. Oh, that takes leather though. That's different. So what do I get? At level 45. I like the looks of the hat. The problem is. It doesn't give me anything different. Or equal to what I have already. So if I'm doing it just for looks. That hat's not really. Worth it. So I just gained 100. Why does it show me revise? So wait, if I revise... Why would I revise it to a lower level? Uh, I'm not understanding... Oh, I can select what attributes I want. Alright, I gotcha. I gotcha. Alright, I'm falling through. I didn't see that last time. Alright, so let's re <laughs> return, confirm. Really, so if I want to revise this up to a level 45 hat, I only need three leather. That seems weird. 500 hit points, right? And that's what I'll ha that's what I have right now, isn't it? Yeah. I'll have to think about that. But I'm learning. We're all learning. Uh, Remington, how you doing? Where's your lemon juice? I'm his BFF, and see, I got relationship points with Arlo and Sam at the same time. Sweet. As lemon juice is. Nope, we're not done. We're not done. I mean, I'm not done done, but... Ah, oh, now the fun task of... I know the market is up a little bit. I do get a discount because we're kind of friends with him. That brings us down to 6,000 ghouls, which is... It's fine. As long as we do commissions every day. And if I get uh, another double rank S commission here or there... We're more than fine. Uh, you can return to your stable, dude. So it's pretty much, I just got to run it around the front and this other side over here. Hmm, really? You know what I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get screwed on? <laughs> I really need to start in this corner, don't I? And that's going to be the hard part. Oh, 
Well, actually, that's easy enough. All right, yeah, that's easy enough. As long as I start... Yes, that's fine. That's fine. That will work. That will work. Come on now. Now, I know I can't place it here or here, but I'll know that's where the steps were. Oh man, this is this is gonna be so calculated. Alright, these will come back up later, but I need these as reference points. Oh man, come on, line up. There we go. Holy crap. Come on. Can I go in here now? Yes, I can. Because the main thing is this get the house in position. And then we can build out around the house as much as we want. And see, those are all off. Does anyone know where my axe is? Because I sure don't. <laughs> am I putting my spare stuff in here? I am. Alright. See, I done and goofed. I hope I'm thinking this through the right way. I am I'm, I'm. I know I'm 100% right, but... Even sometimes when you know you're 100% right, sometimes you're wrong. So I hope that uh, first marble flooring I put down is good. But I want to wait until I have another like 15,000 ghouls so I can buy another 50 tiles, it looks like. Before I can move the house and set it down. Nope. If they just give me some double S rank commissions on conveyor belts for like... Okay, why is that off? Oh, man, these are off. Double fail. Looks like that should line up perfectly. Uh, 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 uh. These were off by a half set. All right. We will get there. We will get there. Someday. <laughs> You probably were, you know, staring at your screen, screaming like, no, you're doing it wrong. You're offset. What an idiot. I mean, I know I'm an idiot, but. And then I can move, like I said, all of our storages up on top on the second floor. go my guess is I may not be able to put them down that close to the uh, maybe I will be able to so once again I'll be doing more grinding in between episodes Basically, I, I just store up on stuff, 
do some relationship stuff, social stuff. I don't go on any dates or play dates or anything like that. I just hand out gifts and let it all work out. There we go. That's the way it should be. I'm not going to put small crock pots around here like this. I just want the foundation to go around it. Butt up right against that. These will come out. There we go. Uh, what to do with our relic scanner? I don't really use it that often. So I'll tell you what we're going to do with it. Uh, we'll rotate it. Put it right here. I was like, yeah, I'm, I'm effing it. <laughs> Why aren't you picking up? Now, the one thing I don't think I've shown yet is I upgraded the relic scanner for the ruins. By upgrading it so you can see, see five of the nearest ones that you scan. Not only does it tell you how far it is from you and all that, it also tell you, tells you what it is. So that's a big bonus. Helps you find things a little bit easier. Holy crap, that house is huge. But now, uh, let me just take something I don't really get into that much wood if we grab our wood storage come up here we can put our chest up here and get it out of the yard since we got that sort all thing going on I'll have to kind of put them in the same order that they were because then I'll, I'll really forget what it is. I mean, the only time you have to grab stuff out of where they are is when you're upgrading something or something, you know, things like that. But for the most part, we don't need it. That'd be great if I could put like a line, that llama statue up here. But it's coming together. And at some point, I want to move these. I'll probably swap these with with a couple of those out back. Because, you know, pe the, the passengers from the port are coming up through here. And they're seeing these tankers. Probably good to see, like, crystal trees or apricot trees. I kind of like this. It feels like I'm, you know, the helm of a ship. Oh, it's 3 o'clock in the morning. Holy crap. Well, guys, that's going to do it for the episode. I hope you enjoyed it. I appreciate you watching as always. And I'll see you next time at my time at Porsche. But until then, have a good one.